Keech's Catechism, questions 31 through 40. Question 31. Wherein did Christ's humiliation consist? Answer. Christ's humiliation consisted in his being born, and that in a low condition, made under the law, undergoing the miseries of this life, the wrath of God, and the cursed death of the cross, in being buried and continuing under the power of death for a time. Question 32. Wherein consists Christ's exaltation? Answer. Christ's exaltation consists in his rising again from the dead on the third day, in ascending up into heaven, in sitting at the right hand of God the Father, and in coming to judge the world at the last day. Question 33. How are we made partakers of the redemption purchased by Christ? Answer. We are made partakers of the redemption purchased by Christ by the effectual application of it to us by His Holy Spirit. Question 34. How does the Spirit apply to us the redemption purchased by Christ? Answer. The Spirit applies to us the redemption purchased by Christ by working faith in us and thereby uniting us to Christ in our effectual calling. Question 35. What is effectual calling? Answer. Effectual calling is the work of God's Spirit, whereby convincing us of our sin and misery, enlightening our minds in the knowledge of Christ, and renewing our wills, He does persuade and enable us to embrace Jesus Christ, freely offered to us in the Gospel. Question 36. What benefits do they that are effectually called partake of in this life? Answer. They that are effectually called do in this life partake of justification, adoption, sanctification, and the several benefits which in this life do either accompany or flow from them. Question 37. What is justification? Answer. Justification is an act of God's free grace, wherein he pardons all our sins and accepts us as righteous in his sight, only for the righteousness of Christ imputed to us and received by faith alone. Question 38. What is adoption? Answer. Adoption is an act of God's free grace, whereby we are received into the number and have a right to all the privileges of the sons of God. Question 39. What is sanctification? Answer. Sanctification is a work of God's free grace, whereby we are renewed in the whole man after the image of God and are enabled more and more to die unto sin and live unto righteousness. Question 40. What are the benefits which in this life do accompany or flow from justification, adoption, and sanctification? Answer. The benefits which in this life do accompany or flow from justification, adoption, and sanctification are assurance of God's love, peace of conscience, joy in the Holy Spirit, increase of grace, and perseverance therein until the end.